Hey guys, what's up? This is Nonline Software, and today I'll be showing you guys how to set up iAds for the iPhone SDK. I have a previous tutorial on this, but um, if you actually tried that, Apple will reject your app because you have to make it so that when an a ad does not appear, to hide it. Okay, so that I'll be showing that how to do that right now. So let's go to Xcode. Go to File, New Project. Do, I'm gonna do a view-based application and for the iPhone. And I'm gonna save this also called iAd. Now you you wanna make sure that you download the iAd uh, package on the developer website. Okay. I'm not gonna show you how to do that just because it's pretty simple. Okay, so once you do that and you install it, you restart Xcode and then you'll start now. So let's go to our frameworks and do Go to that little settings thing and do add existing frameworks. Scroll down until you see iAd.framework and double click on it. Now go to classes, go to the view control.h, and you want to import it. So let's do import and then slash iAd.h. Now after UI view controller, you're going to do add banner view delegate. Okay, and then after the first curly bracket, you're gonna enter twice, and then I'm gonna do an IB outlet space. Oh, sorry, no, no IB outlet. Just do add banner view space star add view semicolon enter bool space banner is visible semicolon, and then after the second curly bracket. You're going to do at property uh, parenthesis non atomic, comma retain, and then do IB outlet space add banner view space star add view semicolon enter at property space bool space banner is visible. Semicolon. Now go to the .m file, and you want to synthesize it. So do at synthesize, and do banner is visible, comma add view, semicolon. Okay, so you want to now enter twice and do dash void, and do banner view did load add, and then. You can do if, oh, sorry about that. You want to stay inside the curly brackets and do if, uh, print, uh, exclamation point, self dot banner is visible. And then inside the brackets, you're going to do UI view space begin animations at parenthesis animate on parenthesis and do context is null bracket semicolon enter. Add view dot frame space equals space CG CG rect offset and then you do add view dot frame zero and then fifty semicolon enter and do bracket UI view commit animations bracket semicolon enter self dot banner is visible is equal to yes semicolon now what this does is that it checks to see if the banner did load the ad and if banner is and if banner is visible is that if that's no or false then you're going to run this action the exclamation point means that it's, it's false okay so after the second curly bracket enter twice and do dash void banner view and then press escape and do did fail to receive add with error Okay, and then inside here, we're going to do if self.banner is visible, you can do bracket UI view, begin animations, add parenthesis, animate off. Parenthesis, context is null, bracket semicolon enter, add view dot frame is equal to CG rect offset, add view dot frame, zero, and then negative 50. 
then semicolon, enter, UI view, commit animations, semicolon, enter, and then self, dot banner is visible is equal to no, semicolon. Now what this does is that it checks if the banner did not load the ad, and if banner is visible is equal to yes, then you're going to make it so that it goes off the screen. See, as you can see, negative 50 as the Y. Okay, and then I'm pretty sure that's it. Actually, sorry, no, we, we need to do one more thing. Go to our view did load method and uncomment it. And then before the super view did load, we're going to enter and do add view space equals space bracket bracket add banner view a lock bracket in it with frame and then do cg rect zero bracket semicolon enter add view dot frame space equals space cg rect offset and then do add view dot frame zero negative fifty semicolon enter Add view dot re, um, require content size identifiers space equal space bracket ns set set with object and then do add banner content size identifier three twenty by five fifty sorry three twenty by fifty semicolon et enter add view dot current content size identifier space equals space add banner view content size identifier 320 by 50 semicolon enter self dot view add sub view add view and then self dot banner is visible is equal to no semicolon oh and then before or sorry after self dot view add sub view you're going to enter and do uh, add view dot delegate is equal to self semicolon okay so what this does is that it just initializes the add view so it uh, tells it what the frame is what like what the dimensions are and you want it to be off the screen at first just because uh, you know if it goes off you want to have it always off screen if it's not showing an ad so that that'll just make it easier to uh, make the program. Okay, so after the void dialog method at the bottom, you're just gonna do enter and do add view dot delegate is equal to nil, and then bracket add view space release semicolon enter. There you go. Now go to our resources. Go to the viewcontrol.nib file. Okay, and I'm gonna drag and you need to drag in an add banner view. And make sure the dimensions are or sorry, the the X and Y is zero and then fifty. Okay, so I'm gonna take off the status bar. Okay, it looks like I lost it. So I'm gonna put it right there. I'm gonna put it at the top. There we go. Save that. Now just build and run. Okay, got a few more minutes left. Now I can't really show you um, to tell it to go off screen just because it does not load an ad on here. But as you can see, it works right there. Okay. And if you guys did not see that, I'll do it again once. The you have to watch closely and you'll see the animation of the ad going down. You can see right there. Okay, so that's how you make it so that if the if the ad does not show an ad to take it off the screen and also if it shows the ad, take it on the screen. So if you guys have been rejected by app um by Apple because of this, this is how you do it. So thank you guys for watching and if you guys would like any more tutorials, please comment below and subscribe. See ya.